Question number three. Given that, okay, so okay, let me just copy this. P power x minus 2 times Q power x plus 2 equals to P x power 2x. Okay, you want to show this. Okay, let me just write at the side. Huh? So we want to show that P x, P Q power x equals to Q over P square. So we have to turn this into this okay so what can we do so we what we can do is we can combine the try to combine the p and q first because you notice that you see this equation here the pq is together with the power x so but here we got power 2 la power negative 2 all inside so we have to split them up first okay so p power if you see this p power x minus 2 is the same as p power x times p power negative 2 right because times means you're going to plus so when you plus you still get back x minus 2 you get back this okay so i just split them apart and this negative 2 is actually a fraction right because p negative 2 is the same as 1 over p square okay if the negative make it become a fraction so i'm going to write this way i'm going to write the p power x over p square i'm going to write like this okay times so this one is the same thing q power x times q square okay equals to p x, p q power 2x okay so now i'm going to combine the x and the x okay the one with the power x so p power x times q power x so i can write like this p q power x okay because i can combine them they have the same power and this and this i can also put them together so times so q square over p square right so i can write q over p then the whole thing square okay i can write like this equals to p q power 2x so now what i can do since i got 2x here and power x here both are the same base p q so i can bring this the other side it becomes divide so it becomes q oh wait sorry q over p square on the left side and on the right side you have p q power 2x so the 2x what i'm going to do is here i'm going to write the x here and i'm going to write 2 outside okay because i'm going to this one means times right so i'm still going to get 2x why am i writing like this because when i bring the divide down here the pq power x you will notice that these two are the same but the only difference is the top one got has got a square and the bottom one got no square so you can actually simplify so you cut this off so there is no more square because you already eliminate one of the pq power x okay so you only have one more pq power x so you got your answer already lah. so your answer is pq to the power f pq to the power of x equals to q over p square so that's the same thing as this okay so shown right question b so express Okay, so this one is a third question in the form of, okay, so bas basically they just want you to rationalize the the third. So we get k over 4 minus 7 plus root 28. Okay, so what we're going to do is we have to rationalize this. So we have to multiply the conjugate. The conjugate will be 4 plus third 7. So here will be 4 plus third 7. Okay, so we're going to multiply. So when we multiply, we will have 4k plus k7 over. So this, guys, for this bottom here, I don't want you all to do manually. Eh? Because there's a way to, doing, of, to do this. So the 4 and the 4, you're going to times, you get 16. And then the 7, third 7 times third 7, you multiply, you're going to get 7 again. Okay, because third times third is, you just cancel it, right? So you only get 7. And the middle here is always going to be negative. Okay, always going to minus. Clear? Plus 28. So what you will have is 4k plus k 7 over 16 minus 7 will give you 9. Okay, so it's 9 here. Now, this one is not a fraction, right? So it's going to be over 1. So I can make it become the same denominator by multiplying 9 multiplying 9 so I get plus 
and right here plus 9 so 28 over 9 so now I can combine the two fractions so I get 4k plus k so 7 plus okay so actually we can simplify this huh? so 9 so 28 is the same as 9 so this 28 is actually 4 times 7 right so the 4 here I can actually root I can square root it, right? So I get 9. So square root of 4 is 2. So 2, so 7. So 9 times 2 is 18, so 7. Okay? So I can just straight away write 18, so 7, over 9. Okay? Then, let me bring it up here. We're almost done. So the so 7 and so 7 you can put together. So you get 4k plus k plus 18 so 7 so i'm factorizing the third 7 out so i can break this into two separate fractions huh? one is with the third 7 one more is with the 4k so i get 4k over 9 plus k plus 18 over 9 third 7 okay i can write like this now it has become the format that they wanted to so the one the format is p plus q so 7. Okay, so we know that P is this and Q is this. Okay, so they didn't ask you to find P and Q, but it is one you to write in this format. So this should be the answer. Okay.